name is Edwin Saw, and I'm going to be teaching these students here today how to do the Adam Iverson drill, which is a basketball drill that improves uh, ball handling. But the first thing we're going to do, we're going to circle up, and we're going to do the most important thing before practice gets started, and that's going to be the warm up. So, uh, can y'all give me a circle for me? I'm just going to do a simple warm up from stretch to get our muscles a little unwound and our muscles. So, uh, just down straight, touching your toes. We're gonna hold each stretch for uh, 10 to 15 seconds, so I'll count it out for y'all. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm just gonna hold it for 10 seconds. I'm gonna go down to the right with your left hand, stretch and touch your right ankle. And hold it for another 10 seconds. One, two, three. Up, I'm going to uh, ask you to show y'all. Okay, as we know, Adam Iverson is one of the best basketball players that we play in the NBA. His game focused on a lot of quickness and ball handling. So this is a drill that he came up with around 1999. And I was uh, taught by my old high school teacher, so he is right now. All right, we're going to start from the baseline. The first time we go around, we're going to be dribbling the ball with our right hand and we're gonna be rolling the ball with our left hand. So, get down in a squatting motion. And keep the right hand on your ball dripping on your fingertips. As we do that, you're gonna roll the ball with your left hand. Keeping your head up and staying focused. We're gonna do this all the way. Get him, make it a 
feel like he's even getting on a little bit lower too. Like this low. Keep it on your finger too. You can go at your own pace. No need to speed or anything. Just do something. For you. It'll help you can't get down a little bit lower. Yeah. It'll make it a lot easier to dribble with your fingertips. Yeah. Just go at your own pace. Try not to let the ball stop the ball that you're rolling and keep it with a steady motion. Now that I know that most of the world is predominantly 90% right-handed, so we're going to do the drill with our left hand to try to improve the ball with our left hand. Might be a little bit more difficult, but y'all go at y'all own pace. And if y'all need to stop, I know it's going to be a little bit harder, but I'm going to be with y'all as y'all doing so. This time you're going to be dribbling with your left hand and rolling with your right hand. A little bit more just. I'm going to hold it. Same thing, just reverse. Now we got the proper stands, we got the proper 
loose box. Yeah, no. Dribble the ball three times, spin the ball, do that same thing every time. It's really about muscle memory. Right, you want to keep your elbow straight. And when you follow through, you want a nice follow through. And put some arch on the ball. The ball can't get to the rim. It's not hard to get up. Give y'all an example. This one got us a little better than our last basketball practice. <laughs> Yeah, that's it. I thought y'all had an Adam Robinson drill. I'd have to break your free throws. So. 